Okay, so uh, what we have here is a 2017 Volvo XC90. Uh, I'm gonna uh, use the uh, infotainment uh, uh, screen. So uh, this is one of my first time uh, to use it. I just uh, opened it a few times. So uh, I don't know the system so, you know, very well. So uh, let's see how it works. Okay, so I guess I have to go to the main screen. Okay, and now to the right, we got some options. We got radio. Okay, how you, let's see how do you scroll. How do you choose the station? This or here? So I'm going to press the search here, okay, so that's how it goes, okay, okay, this is volume, this is pause, okay, so this is how it works, then we go again, and then we go to Sirius, Okay, that works. Okay, then... Oh, Bluetooth is here. Okay, library. So then we can go to Bluetooth. Okay, I don't have any device paired with the car. So, connecting the phone. Okay, here. Okay, so... Then let's see USB AUX. That's what we have here. So we don't have anything connected to it. So then we have messages. Okay. And we have no messages. SMS service unavailable. Okay. Okay, so we go to car status. We have no message, the car is running. Status. Calibration requirement. Calibrate. Okay. So appointments. Okay. With no appointments. This one here is green, green, green. Calibrate. What is this? Person started. Okay. Okay, so it's doing some calibration. Oil is max. So uh, let's see what it's gonna do. It's first time I'm doing this, so I'm learning as I record the video. We'll see what uh, what it come up with. I wonder if you have to drive. Oh, is he CTA? Okay, okay, let's do something else. Okay, now do to what is this travel link? Okay. Oh, okay, alerts. No alerts. Fuel. Okay. Sports. Okay, music, I guess. Weather. Let's see what's the weather. Cloudy. 43 wow that's cold five days oh that's cool 43 oh. not too warm favorites weather okay so now let's go download center 
okay what is this one application updates to local search install let's see what's gonna do park and pay let's say we install this one okay so uh, it's doing it okay light okay so it's installing now local search okay do it do it do it almost done okay installed applications that's what we have installed okay Pandora Yelp okay system updates no updates maps what is this one new too big update to big visit support oh wow oh wow that's how it goes huh no we don't want this okay so it's installing the application okay now it's installing the park and pay application Okay, so it's gonna do that. I hope in while we checking other. Why is the CarPlay not? I wanted to play with the Apple CarPlay. I don't know why it's not. Ah, oh, maybe because we need to pair the need to pair the device. Okay, so we have to add new. Let's see. I think that's what it is. It should find my phone. No devices. Oh, that's not good. Okay, let's see what else we have here. Okay, so navigation. And we can maximize it like that. We can do this okay ahead set destination here or we can use a voice command that is here navigation navigation what do you want to do okay go to Myers Select a POI in the list. Okay. Where's the list? Please repeat. Okay. okay. Sorry, still no match. Say a line number up, okay. down, not in list, or POI along the route. Wow, we don't see any list. That's the problem. Okay. Connecting phone, no phone. This one is gonna be gone. That's the old person's. Okay. Okay, so now we go to this side and then we have ES, ES, ESC sport mode. Turn on. Lane keeping eight on parking. We have a back front bumper removed, so we don't have that. Okay, so the cameras. Okay, here are the cameras. Park in and park out. Wow. Okay, unavailable. 
okay so we have to install the camera the bumper lines okay start stop distance alert cross traffic alert camera park in oh I see park out so the car can park in and park go out of the parking headrest fold okay head up display how do you play with the head up display please and then we have more oh oh there's more okay active beams fog lamp with corner road sign okay so we have some features here okay okay that's how it works then we have temperature okay okay it's not that bad to use it okay so we have heated steering wheel heated seats you press on the seat there are three settings and then steering wheel the same three settings okay and then we have AC on okay auto okay climate on auto okay so it's fairly easy as you can see most of the time we're gonna the screen switch to night mode because of the sensor in the front there so yeah fairly easy I never used it and it's very easy to get used to it driver performance oh that's something new what is this mpg okay preferences 10 miles after every trip okay how do we okay oh here okay yeah so it's easy to use ready okay yeah so there we have it 2017 Volvo infotainment system uh, it, 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 it ha this one mode this one has the uh, autonomous driving mode and uh, as you could see it's got some features that we're gonna uh, review later so yeah that would be for today please subscribe for uh, more videos like that uh, it will be many many more thank you